Hey vlog channel, um, it is Amanda here. I always um, don't know how to say hi to you guys because I'm always, sorry about my laundry, but I'm always like, do I say Amanda Dubé here? Because technically, it is Amanda Dubé here, but I'm not on Amanda Dubé here, I'm on Dubé here vlogs. So maybe I should say, um, hey YouTube, it's Dubé here vlogs. Or it doesn't matter chick, you know who my name is, okay? okay. So anyways, I haven't done um, a weight loss vlog in a while. This is not going to be much of a weight loss vlog. It's going to be more of just a life in general because sometimes I like to update you guys. But I have lost, I think, 40 pounds now. Last time I weighed myself, I was like 0.53 pounds from losing 40 pounds. So I'm sure it's probably 40 pounds by now. So I'll just do a quick uh, look at the progress. So this is my face. My double chin is almost fading, but this bastard ain't trying to leave. And a lot of you guys are like, Amanda, you don't have a double chin. I'm not saying, like, I had, like, literally two chins, but I didn't have, like, a Tyrese, um, Tyrese, what's his, what's his last name? Whatever. I didn't have, like, a strong jawline, so that's all I mean. Um, you know, the muscles are still growing, you know, or are shine. Um, okay. And, uh, since last time I did like a body shot thing so this is me I mean I still look very similar to what I did last time to be honest with you uh, my butt's growing a little bit and yes I'm wearing the skirt backwards mind your business anyway um now that we got that out the way let me just have a seat have several seats and um do you guys mind that this is like super like not really like filmed well like do you guys want me to film this on my um vlog camera i would totally film it on my um actual like youtube video camera but the whole point of this being my vlog channel and just being very chill is i just want everything to be very like as you see it that's why i don't even edit this because i want you guys to just know like what it is what it is what's your so um so never you know what just cancel that question because i really don't mean it i didn't try and do nothing serious um but anyway, um, and I want to get a new camera soon, um, but that's going to be a while, like, until I really, like, feel like, yo, I got money to blow getting it in, making these bills fall over your skin. You know, I'm not trying to buy a new camera, but, like, I would love to get a new camera. I'm just not trying to buy it right now. Um, but anyways, I want to do, like, a vlog. Um, weight loss journey is going well. Now it's a lot easier. Like, now everything that I do in terms of eating right and exercising, it, it almost comes naturally. Like, I don't really have to worry about it so much. I still hate working out. I don't like working out. Nobody really likes working out. It's a freaking drag, you know what I'm saying? But I do it, and eating healthy, it's easy now. It's funny, because the other day I was telling my mom I had a dream that I was eating after 8, and, and you guys know I don't eat after 8, and I had a dream I was eating after 8, and I was like freaking out in the dream, because I was eating like vegetables and fruits, but for some reason I kept forgetting it was after 8, and I, I would just like discard that and keep eating. It was like really, like I didn't like that at all, so thank goodness that was a dream, because I'm not trying to eat after 8. I think that's been the most helpful thing in my journey to really restrict myself um, in time eating because I used to not eat a lot during the day. I just ate a lot at night and um, that's probably what made me gain weight is because when you eat at night, you don't actually have time to digest the food. But if you eat during the day, then the food digests and by the time you're going to sleep, it, your body's really working. You know what I'm saying? I don't know the technical terms, but sweetheart, you get what I'm trying to say and you've heard it before. Um, I'm wearing my Drake shirt. I just filmed the video for my main channel and I love this shirt I never wear this shirt the funny thing is when I got this shirt it was like it was like it wasn't tight but it didn't fit really baggy and I would have to like stretch it like I would do this with my hands and like stretch it like that um but now I just put it on and it just freaking fits so I'm really glad about that because it's so it's so loose like naturally by itself I don't really have to do anything which is cool because a lot of my clothes are looser now and um I used to have to um I used to do this thing. It's really funny, actually, quite ghetto. But anytime I wash a shirt, it like shrink a little bit. So I'd like kind of stretch it. Like I put my hands in it and do this. And I never do that for any of my clothes now. And a lot of my clothes fit loose. And I need to start going shopping for more form-fitting clothes because um, I used to wear baggy clothes in general. So can you imagine once you lose forty pounds and you're still wearing the same baggy clothes you were in before? Like I look so stupid. And I feel like sometimes I'll see someone I haven't seen in a while. 
And I'll be wearing one of my, like, boyfriend tees because I ain't got no boyfriend. I bought the tee myself, but whatever. And I feel like they can't even see how much weight I lost because the clothes I'm wearing are so big. Like, really, the only thing that they can notice is my face. So I really do need to go shopping for some different clothes. But I'm still not comfortable wearing tight, tight clothes, like bodycon stuff. Um... I don't think I'm ready there yet. Like, I'm, I'm going to need a flat stomach before you see me rocking these body calm skirts all the damn time. Because I'm not trying to wear Spanx. Spanx are uncomfortable. Like, I can't breathe in that. You know what I mean? But, um, you know, soon enough I'll get there. And it's funny because I started this... I mean, this was very much so in the summer, so maybe by next summer I'll be looking fly as a motherfucker. Um, but, yeah, anyways, I have my uh, green tea here. But yeah, I mean, that's kind of my update. Um, dating still sucks. I mean, um, you don't really get a lot of dating in Vancouver, to be honest with you. There's, there, You don't really meet a lot of people like that. But I know what I like, and I know what I want, and I don't think I want a relationship actually right now. I just want to focus on myself. I mean, I'm on this huge journey to just change my life and I just kind of think it's it's best to, to focus on me uh, granted if I met you know a cute ma effa you know who dressed nice and wore like a nice gold chain like a thin one not like mine but like a thin one I mean he could wear something like mine I just don't know if he could work in the way I do but you know some cute mother effa with a nice snapback girl oh give me that sleeve tattoo maybe a little bit on his neck girl <laughs> Then I might change my mind, but at the moment, I'm really just focusing on myself, and um, I recently just left Mac. I work there on call now, so I'm not working as much, so I'm trying to really change careers and figure out what the I want to do with my life, because I felt like I was just standing still, and I felt like I wasn't really moving, and if I was moving, it wasn't necessarily in the direction that I wanted, so I'm really taking charge of my life. I'm actually going to get my L, my learner's permit, so I can learn how to drive, so I can pick up my hose, you know what I'm saying, um, but yeah, I'm really focusing on myself, so I don't know if I really do have time for anybody else in that frame, um... So, yeah, I'm not too worried about dating, um, although I'm not getting any younger. <laughs> okay. But, yeah, I mean, I'm just really enjoying life. I'm very, very happy. A lot has changed in the past, like, six, seven months of my life. Um, but it's good changes, and um, I think it's just, you know, your 20s are the years where you're building yourself as a person, and you're figuring out who you are, who you want to be, who your friends are, and um, I'm enjoying it. I'm learning, I'm having some hardships, but I'm, you know, having fun doing it. So, yeah, that's pretty much it for my vlog. Um, let me know what's going on in your life. And for the people who did embark on this weight loss journey when I did, um, let me know how it's going. And I'm so happy when you guys tell me that I inspire you. Like, I get so many people saying that. And it honestly, it makes me so happy because I never thought I could inspire people to lose weight. I mean, I knew I could inspire people for happiness and, and maybe fashion, but to change their life to better themselves, I mean, that's amazing. So thank you so much because you guys inspire me by telling me that. That makes me want to work extra hard because I know that I got like an audience, you know what I'm saying? So thank you for watching. I hope you guys enjoy. Uh, let me know. If you guys want me to talk about any specific things, let me know. You know, if you guys want me to talk about the tribe and people that I've met because, like I said, I'm not dating, but I've met some dudes. They just make me think, oh my gosh, like, and I, sometimes I think I'm picky because, no, I just meet guys that are pieces of SHIT to be real with you. But anyways, that's neither here nor there. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed and uh, I love you. I do, I do, I do, she has.